Stimulus payments are going out to millions of Americans. There are several states who have stepped up to the plate to send their residents some relief checks. Stay tuned to find out if it's your state that is actually sending them out this month. Guys, this video is loaded with information. You may be surprised on which states are actually stepping up to help their residents. Several of you guys have been asking for those individual states that are actually doing something, which states are on the list. And guys, we have some very surprising news. Hey, what is up YouTube? Welcome back to another show where we keep you updated on everything stimulus, the states that are actually sending them out. And guys, have we some information for you. Some states are stepping up to make sure that their residents get paid this month. Yes, this month. So guys, we've got all that news that you do not want to miss. It's actually been a huge surprise. And we also have some great news about the $250 stimulus check. Well, guys, we've hit 69,000 subscribers, and when we hit 70,000, then two lucky subscribers get to win the $250 prize, which is amazing because you can do a lot with $250. We're also doing a free meal giveaway where you can say that the meal is on us from these three restaurants. All you gotta let us know is which restaurant that you want. Guys, we're doing a ton of giveaways and we just wanna say thank you for everything that you do. And all you gotta do to jump on these prizes is hit that subscribe button and smash that like button. So there are so many things that are going on. Like Joe Biden is actually doing some good things. Finally, right? So he says in an article that failure was not an option here, how Biden navigated a political and economic minefield at a critical moment in rail negotiations. In other words, he stepped up and he made sure that he made them happy because if not, they were about to go on strike and uh, we were gonna be in a very, very bad place. But why don't you hear it from the man himself, President Joe Biden. Agreement is a big win for America and for both, in my view. I want to thank the lead negotiators and the, from the labor movement, the Brother of Locomotive Engineers, the trainmen, International Association of Sheet Metal and Air and Rail and Transportation Workers Union, and the other labor unions engaged. And this is a win for tens of thousands of rail workers and for their dignity and the dignity of their work. It's a recognition of that. During these early, dark, uncertain days of the pandemic, they showed up so every American could keep going. They worked tirelessly through the pandemic to ensure that families and communities got the deliveries they needed during these difficult few years. And because of the labor agreement, those rail workers will get better pay, a 24 percent wage increase over the next five years, improved working conditions, Peace of mind around their health care by capping the cost that workers will have to pay. And it's about the right to go to a doctor or stay healthy and make sure you're able to have the care you can afford. It's all part of this agreement. They earned and deserve these benefits. And this is a great deal for both sides, in my view. The agreement is also a victory for railway companies. And I want to thank the lead negotiators from the railway the National Railway Labor Conference and our major rail companies. These companies also played a, uh, a critical role in keeping America moving during the pandemic, and that's not hyperbole, it's a fact. With this agreement, railroad companies will be able to retain and recruit workers. They'll be able to continue to operate effectively as a vital piece of our economy. They're really the backbone of the economy. I have this visual image of rails being the backbone. I mean, literally, the backbone of the economy. So I thank the unions and the rail companies for negotiating in good faith. They met up for 20 straight hours through that negotiation. And, uh, and for sticking with it, especially over the last few days. So guys, with elections coming up, there is no way that Joe Biden could let the railroad people go on strike when he is trying to win the elections. So he stepped up and man, was this place smart on their end. Midterm elections are in November and these guys were literally about to go on strike and you know what would happen to our economy? It would have went down the drain, but I am thankful that he stepped up to the plate and he made something happen. Now, let's get on to the stimulus 
stimulus news that you guys came for. So all right guys, so concerning stimulus updates and those that are looking for stimulus news, here are five must know facts about a fourth stimulus check. So number one, an amazing thing to know is that federal stimulus checks won't be coming by before election by the federal government like Congress and those in the Senate, the White House. It's coming by the individual states. So the state that you live in has the opportunity to send you some relief checks. The biggest question is which states are doing that. Number two, worsening the economic conditions would be likely necessary for another stimulus check. So in other words, things had to get horrible before they will actually send out a check, which doesn't make any sense because people need help now. Number three, parents are more likely than non-parents to get more stimulus money, which in itself makes sense just because they have more dependents. Number four, almost half of all states are sending stimulus checks or have done so already. So there has been a huge amount of states who have stepped up to send their residents stimulus checks. That's some very, very good things. And number five is a very key thing. You may be owed some money from the last payments. Finally, you could potentially get another stimulus payment if you did not receive all of the money that was owed to you. So that is something that you would want to check with to make sure that you got every penny that was owed to you. So now let's get on to the direct payments that are being sent out to residents this month. So direct relief check update, millions get up to $3,284 soon. Millions of Americans will soon receive financial relief in the form of direct payment as high as $3,284, and that is the state of Alaska. So they are going to get that huge, huge relief check. I know that there would be so many people that would be looking forward to getting that type of check. So California, eligible Californians will start receiving a one-time payment from October, okay? So that middle-class tax refund will be sending out payments ranging from $200 to $1,050 to 23 million Californians, okay? So that's what's happening in California. Virginia is sending out a one-time tax rebate to eligible residents. They would receive $250 if they filed their taxes individually and $500 if they filed jointly. And this is when they're supposed to receive. So they are expected to be sent their rebate by October 17th and receive it by October 31st, which is around Halloween. And then again, we found some more updated information. And remember, it's our job to tell you the truth and give you all the information that is most up to date. So this information came out today, stimulus payments coming to these states in September 2022. Well, we know that Hawaii sent them out just last week. Illinois started sending them out Monday. California is sending them out in October. Colorado, this is a state we need to look into. So they are sending out stimulus checks and they said that if you haven't received your check, you can check the status by calling this number 303-951-4996. If you live in Colorado and you are supposed to be getting a stimulus check and you haven't seen it, if you want to check the status, then call that number. Indiana has been sending out their payments to their residents since last month, and they have printed out 1.7 million checks that they're sending out to their residents, and they said that they would try to get them all out by the end of the year. Massachusetts is working on sending out a stimulus check to the residents, and they really haven't come up with a price or an amount yet, so they are waiting on the auditor to reveal the figure by September 20th. So that's when those in Massachusetts will know how much they will be getting. New Jersey is doing big things for homeowners and they're trying to send out at least 450 all the way up to $1,500 and those checks will be coming no later than May 2023. 
New York is sending out residents of Manhattan and other New York cities boroughs can look forward to these property tax rebates of $150. So there again, I know New York's governor looked up and said, we're going to send $270 to eligible residents that they need help with this inflation. So that is being worked on as we speak. Pennsylvania has been surprisingly sending out stimulus checks. Here's the biggest thing with Pennsylvania. There are Pennsylvanians that may receive $250 and a max of $650. Residents need to apply by December 31st, 2022, right here. And I'll link this information down in the description below. But yet again, they're providing a property tax rent rebate program that residents 65 years or older or age 50 years and older and widowed or 18 plus with disability may qualify. So if you're in Pennsylvania and you're looking for some relief with your property tax or your rent rebate, then this program is designed for you to provide you with some relief money. And this link here will take you to the application that you need to fill out and you have to get it done this year so that way you can get your check or get some sort of direct deposit by this fall, guys. So you might wanna jump on that as soon as possible. And again, I will put that information down in the description below, so that way you don't have to go searching for it. It'll be right there for you. So guys, that is all the information that I have for you today. I wanna to thank you so much for watching, your love and support. It means the world to me. Guys, we've been getting hundreds and hundreds of subscribers every single day, and it's all because because of you guys. I love you. Thank you so much for everything that you do for me and this channel. Don't forget to like and subscribe for your chance to win one of these really cool prizes. Guys, stay tuned for more videos to come. And until next time, I'm John Miro. Peace.